Lesson 11, Absolute Value of Inequalities, Advanced Technique Number 1. And we have to solve that the absolute value of x plus 1 plus the absolute value of x minus 1 is greater than 4. Now I'm going to let y equal the absolute value of x plus 1 plus the absolute value of x minus 1. Then I'll remove the absolute value signs and I get x plus 1 plus x minus 1. Now this is okay so long as x plus 1 is greater than or equal to 0 and also x minus 1 is greater than or equal to 0. That is x is greater than or equal to negative 1 and x is greater than or equal to 1. Now clearly this is the condition we're going to impose on the answer. This becomes y equals 2x. I might just draw a little graph over here seeing what's going on. So what we've got now 1, x equals 1, y equals 2, so it's 2 up there, we have this graph coming in like that. Alright, second bit, we'll make this part negative, so it's minus x minus 1 plus x minus 1. Conditions are that x plus 1 is less than 0, let's equal 0, Less than naught, sorry, and scroll that out. And we're going to have the second bit here is x minus one is going to be greater than or equal to zero. That is, x is less than negative one, and x is greater than one. But it can't both be; they can't happen, can it? We can't have it being less than minus 1 and greater than 1 so this is this condition is out we can't use that now take another one y is equal to x plus 1 plus or minus x plus 1 and that's the case when x plus 1 is greater than 0, greater than 0, and x, uh, x, x minus 1 is less than equal to 0. Watch these things a bit hard to fathom after a while. It becomes x is greater than or equal to negative 1, and x is less than 1. That's okay, is that because they're in between those two. and we draw, we have that, we get 2. Alright, so between 1 and minus 1, y equals 2. That's correct, over here. It's going to go like that. Right, and finally, we have, I'll just rub some of this stuff off here. Let's see what's going on. Bit of room. Okay, we have the condition that two negatives, y equals minus x minus 1, then we have plus minus x plus 1, that's minus 2x, and that's when x plus 1 is less than or equal to 0, and x minus 1 is less than or equal to 0, that is x less than negative 1 or x is less than 1. Now clearly this one will dominate and we're going to have y equals minus 2x and that will look like this up here. Now we then draw y equals 4. y equals 4 which would be sitting up here somewhere. And we're going to find those points of intersection. So I'm going to put it in, into y equals 2x, when y equals 2x, okay, we put y equals 4 in here, so 4 equals 2x, x equals 2, and on the other side over here, 
y equals minus 2x, x will be equal to minus 2 down there. And we're saying that this has always got to be bigger than 4. And that will occur here and over here. And so the final solution is that x has got to be greater than 2 or x has got to be less than minus 2 is our final solution. Now this particular type is used in the more advanced courses. In the New South Wales course this would be an extension 2 type. You would not see it in the extension 1 in, in New South Wales.